What's going on, swing traders? Today I'm gonna do Hexo, H-E-X-O. That's the ticker symbol. Whoa. Hold off on buying it because I don't like the price where it's at right now and I think it's gonna dip a little bit more. So I want you to get a really good price on it. So if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to hit the like button down below. Now let's get right into this marijuana company, Hexo. Boom, chicka, boom, chicka, bop, bop. So as you can see here, Hexo has been dropping pretty good. And you know me, I like to buy stocks when they're tanking. But anyways, let's take a look at why they have been dropping. So Hexo's revenue in the third quarter was 2.8% lower than its revenue in the second quarter. So they missed by $1.78 million. But the bottom line is Hexo lost $7.75 million in the third quarter. And I'm just speaking off the top of my head right here. I don't really don't know if this is true or not, but... I think the reason why they're actually losing all this money is because they're building that huge facility. So a lot of money is being invested into that. So that's why they're not really making these results that they want to. And right here is their facility. You can see that they're building. It's going to be massive. And also that's part of the reason why this stock is in dilution right now. Basically, the company needs money to help grow this huge facility. That's right. Dilution is going on right now in Hexo, which is why I think it's going to go lower than what it is right now. But I still like it for a swing trade. So this is the CEO, Sebastian, I think his name is. And I just watched a video of him and he is intense. What's going on, guys? Hexo is going to make us tons of money. We have a huge facility. So here we are with a chart set up. Zoom in here real quick. And I got resistance here at about 550. And you can see it got rejected off there just about twice. And we got a big old red candlestick. That was today. So I'm looking at support here right around 488. It doesn't mean I'm going to buy it at 488. I'm just going to see if it holds it. And if it breaks through 488, it looks like we're going to go all the way down here to about four, just make it $4, which I think $4 would be a great buy on this company because it's not going to stay down there that long. So that's my game plan to basically see what it's going to do when it hits this 488 because I believe it is going to go down to it. The question is, is it going to bounce off of it or is it just going to dart right through it? Oh. Where do you set alerts? All right, guys. Well, it's a swing trade. You got to hold off for a little bit, but it's going to train you guys to set alerts and to be patient. But I think this stock does have some very good potential. It's just the price that you want to get it at. So just like a reminder to subscribe to my channel and like this video because I know you enjoyed it. I know you did. Let's make some money.